Hello everybody, it's Vertical Sandwich! We are investigating things in shadows. It's full of books, you don't have time to read every one of them. Think of your quest! Can I open it though? That's the question. You open the book and read it. And when the Warlock Lord has finally gained power, he went up against the Great Kings. The evil one would have succeeded if not for the Circle of Twelve. If he ever returns to power, Tarkus will not live to see the rising sun. Whatever. Who cares about Tarkus? Okay. Now what we should do is open these scrolls that we just got. Scroll 4 is open. You've read the scroll. To move the sun from far to near, light is what the darkness fears. In statum aluminum or something. Lands under the heaven, the key to the world. Terra Terrac! Alright, well we got some new magic, that's cool. It smells like a kennel in here, and there are no windows through which to circulate the air. Okay, well we can take some stuff, let's take some stuff. Let's take this, what is this, a horseshoe? Bottle four. Bottle two. Test tube. Bottle two. Bottle three. Silver vial. Oh, okay, so that's the light one. Let's look at this. Ugh, there's a strange, poisonous looking liquid in the pot. It really stinks. Um, okay save our game because I'm pretty sure I know what's going to happen when we open the the kennel thing there. You remove the latch and a mutated dog pounces on you. It looks like the doctor put something strange in the dog's water. Before you can do anything else, the mutation quickly rips you apart. That was quick. Wow. Man, it really, it, it's not very... We are losing torches every time we do this, by the way. Okay. Alright, you stand in a small garden, the only sound is a falling water in the night. Can I take the thing? As you reach for the flute, you touch the water, and pain explodes through your hand. The water is extremely acidic and obviously not good for drinking. Okay. Uh. I'm gonna end up. I'm seriously gonna end up running out of these dumb things, aren't I? Torches, that's what I meant to say. Okay, well... Let's use... Battle 3. Let's use... Battle 4. Fine, let's get out of here. Alright, interesting. Torch the tapestry. There we go. That's the one we needed. So there's a key. So let's take this this thing. The crest. 
the mirror. We'll open all the doors. All the doors are locked. Okay. Okay, key five doesn't work on that. Key four we already tried, right? Okay, we don't have a key for that. Okay, well, cool, we can... Torches, awesome. From this windy ledge, you can get an idea of the size and strength of the castle. Lightning lights up the countryside as you stand on the lookout point. Okay, well, let's... As you move the pot, you realize that you have fallen for the oldest trick in the book. You suddenly find yourself knee-deep in the moat! Seems that the alligators really enjoy your company. Well, there's a solution to that, I think. Bottle two on herself. Okay, fine. So we don't need that thing, apparently. Oh, so mount of some sort, perhaps for a flagpole. Let's try our scepter. I don't think it gets used here, but something does. Okay, out we go. I hate having to page through all this stuff just to get to my torches, for crying out loud. And it's, it's like backwards, too. That like the every, like the first list is at the bottom. You're in a small throne room. A skeleton wearing a gold crown sits on a throne in front of you. Now this actually... I think this is where we use the scepter. Oh, and then, uh, as soon as you give the scepter to the skeleton, the seal on the pillar lowers. You can now see a ring-shaped hole. We don't have a ring. We do still have a gem, though, right? A red one?
All right. It appears to be a sphinx that looks at you indifferently. There's anything we can speak to. Okay, so look at that. Three, two with one down, one with two down, uh, levers and stuff. It doesn't seem to understand what you say. You have some of those thick. It has the body of a lion and the head of a man. Well, good for it. As you move the sphinx spoke, who are you? No one may pass without my permission. To pass, you must answer a riddle. I have no eyes, but once did see. Thoughts had I, but now I'm white and empty. Dost thou know? Bring me the answer to my riddle, and I shall let thee pass. So the answer clearly is skull. We have like three of those. You have correctly answered my riddle, warrior. Thou may now pass. So, we can get past the Sphinx. Bye, everybody.